Here's the uh, T34. Um, I've actually taken out the gearboxes, which was quite nifty. Um, it's now just one little plate and four screws here, 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 and here, which are located here, 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 and here on the tanks. Um, thank you, plane. I'll let you guys hear that. Um, once you actually remove those four screws, um, the whole gearbox will come out, and you're left with this. Okay, now this is a new way. We have not done this yet um, as far as um, how we remove the gearboxes. Now, if you guys notice, the final gear is still in there. Okay, and it is actually part of the metal chassis here. Um, this is where it connects in. Let's go ahead and move that. Now, an easy way to get these off is to do this little neat trick here. Okay? See that? Yeah, there's a nice little nifty uh, swivel there. So there's a screw here and here, and it's on the other side as well. And that allows this to swivel. Okay? Now when you get to a certain point on the swivel here, right there, you can just pull it off there. And we can press it out, and there you go. Now, something you guys should probably notice on this final drive is bearing here. Okay. And where this end of the gear comes in, on this plate here, if you guys can see that, is another bearing. So yes, you guys are right, they do have bearings. So we now have bearings on the drive wheels the road wheels and idler wheels. Um, so here's the road wheels. Give you a little bearing test here. So quite nice on the bearings. Definitely a um, new addition we like. And let's take a little closer look at the gearboxes here. If you notice this is one big solid gear on here. It looks like two gears, but it's actually one. And then we have one big middle gear here, and then the first gear here. So these are the three to one reductions right here, and then the fourth reduction, which is right here. So it is a four to one with bearings. So I thought you guys would uh, enjoy this video.